5 Internet Tips Every Direct Sales Consultant Should Implement If you're starting a new direct sales business and feeling overwhelmed with Web 2.0, you're not alone. You're already busy setting up your business and now you've got to think about having an online presence too. Where do you start, right? I can relate because I was trying to implement everything at once and felt so burned out. To be successful, you don't need to do everything i.e. pay-per-click, article marketing, video marketing, social media, and so forth. You can always add on. Keep it simple and implement a few things, keep your focus on mastering a few things like setting up a blog or website. It's better to be an expert on a few topics rather than being a generalist and doing everything with mediocrity. Here are 5 tips to have an online presence. Set up a blog There's a ton of online resources on blogging. Whether to choose WordPress or Blogger, why blogs increase more traffic than a static website, and so much more. You will find more info than I could offer in this short post. However, here are 3 tips. Narrow your topic to a few niche ones or on topics that you have a lot of knowledge in. You cannot be an expert and cover everything. Concentrate on writing great content and continue learning copy slash ad writing. Plan on adding at least two to three posts a week to beef up the content of your blog. Until you have enough content, some blog search engines like Blog Catalog won't accept your blog submission. Some excellent blogs to check out are Copyblogger, problogger.net, and daily blog tips. Commenting on other blogs in your niche market is a really good way to build rapport with other bloggers and learn from them too. Syndicate everywhere content is king and so is syndication. The importance of syndicating your blog will increase your search engine rankings and create more visibility for your blog. If you're not indexed by search engines i.e. Google, Yahoo, RSS directories, or blog search engines then you're not being found by your prospects, customers, and potential business partners that are looking to join your business. Tip, think keywords and search words or phrases whenever you're writing but don't fill every single line with keywords either. Balancing strong keywords and writing in a way that's engaging to your audience. Don't write just to fill up space. Social networks If you do a search for social networks, your head will spin because there are so many. Invest in building genuine relationships on Facebook, Twitter, or LinkedIn. Facebook to me is more friendish and Twitter can get you spammed by a ton of peeps promoting their business opportunities and products. I'm becoming a huge of LinkedIn and the potential of LinkedIn's groups. Sometimes smaller niche social networks will give you greater visibility in reaching a more targeted audience. Tip, don't get sucked into socializing because it will be counterproductive. You can be productive and socialize by keeping it to 30 minutes a day on social networks. With Twitter, focus on retweeting if you find something valuable and use it reply to engage with your followers and start having conversations. Do not spam your followers or constantly promote your products or business opportunity. Niche social networks Niche social networks can be a great resource to meet people in your niche market. Ming offers thousands of groups and LinkedIn is excellent and has huge potential. There are forums for direct sales and network marketing entrepreneurs. Groups are also a good place to meet people that are selling similar products or share similar interests. For example, WAHM Forum has thousands of members that are in direct sales and network marketing. If you're in the clothing or fashion business, you might check out StyleHive which has a community, tags, and group for like-minded people. Social bookmarking sites are underutilized and quite effective, leverage a community start commenting on other blogs in direct sales. Add their blogs to your blog role, link to their posts often, syndicate by retweeting or share with your Facebook friends. Your direct sales pals will appreciate it if the content is relevant and valuable. Reach out to your team members and uplines that have blogs. Ask them to link your blog to theirs and network with fellow consultants. As long as your goal is to help build each other's business, the collaboration will enhance your business and you'll develop new friendships too.